I'm a kangaroo living Australia. I love to do the skipping and jumping every day. I have a pouch to carry my joy safely. Come on everyone, let's all fun with me. I'm a kangaroo living Australia. I love to do the skipping and jumping every day. I have a pouch to carry my joy safely. Come on everyone, let's all fun with me. Bing, 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 bing. Hi everyone. How do you feel today? Oh great. It's the time to learn literacy. Are you ready? Do you like to learn literacy? Do you remember our last lesson? Which letter we have learned? We learned all about letter J. Today we are going to learn all about letter K. Which letter we are going to learn? All about letter K. So far we have learned 10 letters. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. Including 3 vowels. A, E, I. These are vowels. Today we are going to learn all about letter K. And K is a consonant. As you all know, there are two types of letters. Uppercase and lowercase. First I am going to show you how to write uppercase K. First I am going to show you how to write uppercase K. Listen carefully. Look at the bird. You all know this is headline. This is leg line. These are two tummy lines. Headline, leg line, two tummy lines. Uppercase K we start from the headline and it goes down to the second tummy line, a standing line. We'll go back to the first tummy line and we'll make a slanting line up to headline. One more slanting line up to second tummy line. This line should be slanting. One more time I will show you a standing line. Go back to the first tummy line, a slanting line and another slanting line up to second tummy line. One more time I will show you a standing line up to the second tummy line. Go back to the first tummy line, a slanting line and a slanting line. This letter we call as Mother K, capital K, big K and uppercase K. Now let's see how to write lowercase K. Starts from the headline and it goes to the second tummy line same way. Go to the middle of the two tummy lines and make a slanting line up and slanting line down. One more time I will show you. Standing line, go back to the middle of the tummy lines, slanting line and slanting line. One more time. Standing line, yes. Middle will make a slanting line and slanting line. Are you ready to practice with me? We'll practice both the letters together. See, first uppercase K, standing line, a slanting line, a slanting line. A standing line goes up to the second tummy line. 
go to the middle slanting line slanting line standing line slanting line slanting line now we will practice lowercase k standing line go down to the second tummy line go to the middle of the two tummy lines slanting line slanting line standing line goes to the second tummy line and go to the middle and slanting line and slanting line one more time standing line Go to the middle of the two tummy lines, slanting line, slanting line. This we call as lowercase k, baby k, small k, simple k. If we call this as mother k, this will become baby k. If we call this one, Big K, then small K. Capital K, simple K. Uppercase K, lowercase K. Do they look same or different? Even though they look same, one is big and one is small. What is the sound of letter K? What is the sound? K, 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 k. Now let's see what are the words starts with letter K. Number one, kangaroo. Do you like to see kangaroo? Kangaroos live in Australia continent. They have very strong back legs and short front legs. They can jump. Female kangaroos, they have a pouch to carry their babies. Do you like to jump like a kangaroo? Number two, kite. Kite is a toy. It's actually a structure. We can make different shape of kites and we can decorate it nicely. After decorating the kite, we can fly it in the sky. Do you like to fly the kites in the sky? Number three, kettle. Kettle is a pot specialized to boil the water. Kettle has a lid, handle, and spout. When the water boiling, there is sound coming from the kettle. Number three, king. King is a person who ruled the country. He has a power. He is the first person in the country. King is bearing a crown. Number five, kiwi. Kiwi is a small fruit. It has a brown color uh, skin and inside flesh is green color. Sometimes it's golden color. There are tiny black seeds that are edible. And kiwi has a sweet and unique flavor. Do you remember our let's learn about the fruit? We learned about kiwi. Do you like to eat kiwi? Now you know five words starts with letter K. Are you ready to remind all the words which we learned today? Number one, kangaroo. Number two, kite. Number three, kettle. Number four, king. Number five, kiwi. Now you know how to write letter K and the sound of letter K. And what are the words starts with letter K? Are you ready to sing the jolly phonic song? This song I'm going to sing about K. 
kites. Are you ready to start? One, two, three, start. Kites are flying in the sky. Ka -ka -ka. Kites are flying in the sky. Ka -ka -ka. Kites are flying in the sky. Kites are flying in the sky. Kites are flying in the sky. Ka -ka -ka. One more time. Kites are flying in the sky. Ka -ka -ka. Kites are flying in the sky. Ka -ka -ka. Kites are flying in the sky. Kites are flying in the sky. Kites are flying in the sky. Ka -ka -ka. Now you know how to write letter K. The sound of letter K. What is the sound of letter K? K, -k. And what are the words touch with letter K? And the jolly phonic song of letter K. It's the time to do the hands-on activities. Are you ready? Hi children, it's the time to do the hands-on activities. Before hands-on activities, make sure to wear your apron. Today I'm going to use Play-Doh for this activity. I have pink color and blue color Play-Doh. So, I'm going to make letter K with Play-Doh. Instead of Play-Doh, you can use semolina, squishy bags, pipe cleaners, popsicle sticks, many things. First, I'm going to make uppercase K. You can use two hands and roll. We will make standing line. Yes. This is uppercase K. The standing line. See, this is standing line. We need another two small lines. Roll like this. This is very good activity to develop fine motor skills. Yes, one slanting line like this, and another slanting line like this. This is Mama K. Now I am going to show you how to do lowercase k. First we want to do the standing line. Yes. Start. And very small. This is Mama K and this is Baby K. You can practice with your Mama. I hope you really enjoy my video. My next lesson is letter L. All about letter L. Thank you so much. See you soon. Bye-bye.